Today we enter into the beautiful promise of God in Ezekiel 36, 26, which says, I will give you a new heart and place a new spirit within you. The Holy Spirit desires to make you holy as he is holy, to be sinless, to be fully in God's kingdom of life and love, and to be out of the enemy's kingdom of sin and death. Jesus says in scripture, unless you change and become like a child, you cannot enter the kingdom of God. Jesus desires that you have a childlike heart that is pure, humble, and docile to the Heavenly Father's will. Last summer, my little nephew, who was about one and a half years old at the time, went to his grandparents' home for a visit. He was outside with his grandpa, walking around the garden and looking at the beautiful flowers, when suddenly he bent down and began digging up a weed in the dirt. His grandpa asked him, what are you doing? And he said, making grandma happy. That was such a beautiful example to my heart of how Abba Father must look upon us as his children and how happy we make God's heart when we cooperate with his grace to have sin uprooted within our hearts. And so now Jesus desires that you turn your gaze upon him who is your true identity and allow him to show you the areas of sin within that must go. Jesus wants you to come with your heart open and not to be afraid to show him your heart because he will not shame you or condemn you for he is love and mercy itself. And out of his great love, Jesus has given us his blessed mother to help us in this battle against sin. And her immaculate heart is our refuge. Once in Medjugorje, one of the visionaries asked Our Lady, why are you so beautiful? And Our Lady responded, because I love. So the Blessed Mother desires to help you to be full of God's love as she is and to be free from sin. Allow her to walk with you in this journey of purification, to fully enter into God's kingdom of light and to allow the Holy Spirit now to illumine your heart to show you the areas of sin that he desires to uproot so that you may fully experience the joy of being a child of God in his kingdom. God bless you.